Yo, what's up guys? I'm Tiger with Tiger Upcom Video back with another Dokkan battle video. So one topic that has been on the minds of a lot of my fellow global players recently is this Christmas summon ticket that currently has no use whatsoever in the game. And recently I've been getting a lot of questions and DMs from people asking me exactly what I think this Christmas ticket is for. So in today's video, we're gonna talk about it. But before we proceed any further, I do want to be very, very clear about the fact that at this point in time, I really have no idea exactly what it's for. I can't give you guys any official information. So you can kind of see this video as more of a speculation slash educated guess about what we can do with this in the future. Um, so, you know, there's definitely a chance that I'm correct about everything I say in this video, but there's also a fair chance a fair likelihood that everything I say from this point on is completely wrong so as long as you guys are okay with that then keep watching and without further ado let's jump into it so like I said recently been getting a lot of questions a lot of people just asking me yo tiger what do you think is it gonna be for is it gonna be like a special banner or like what's the banner gonna look like and so on and so forth as such I've been giving this a lot of thought recently and I gotta say when I first saw this ticket in the news, I thought it was going to be for the Super Saiyan Blue Kaioken Goku banner that we just got for part one of the celebration, right? But um, when the banner came out, of course, there was no associated ticket banner, so that theory kind of fell flat on its face pretty quickly. And then my mind went to part two of the celebration, where I think most people are in agreement that we are going to be getting the LR Kale and Khalifla Legendary Summon banner because First of all, we're long overdue for it, but also because there are just a lot of signs pointing towards the imminent release of LR Kale and Khalifla, such as the Universe 6 story event where the medals to awaken this LR are uh, farmable there, and uh, some other things too that I won't talk about in today's video, but essentially I think it's very likely we will be getting this banner in part 2 of the celebration, I would actually be very shocked if we don't. So as such, I was like, maybe the tickets can be used towards this banner right here for a few free chances to potentially pull LR Kale and Khalifla. That'd be pretty nice too. I think I'd be totally okay with that, right? But then I looked more into it and I realized that it actually says the summon ticket is for the Merry Christmas Dokkan Festival Ticket Summon, right? And since the LR Kale and Khalifla banner is a legendary summon banner and not a Dokkan Fest banner, um, it's definitely, we can confirm for sure that it's not for any upcoming legendary summon banner for part two, right? Whether it's Kale and Khalifla or not. So yeah, that theory also died. But then I gave it a little bit more thought. And do you guys remember that thank you celebration slash Tanabata banner? that we were supposed to get for part two of the thank you celebration this year with the LR GoBros and the LR Super Saiyan Force featured that we didn't end up getting. And it was just a huge, huge disappointment to, I think most people, I mean, especially me, you could just see the pain and sadness on my face as I was going through the news in that video. But anyways, even though it sucked, even though it was a massive disappointment, I still held out the hope, I still firmly believed that at some point down the line, at some time in the future, we would still be seeing that banner on Global. And guys, I think that time is now. I think part two of the thank you celebration is not only gonna feature the release of the LR Kale and Khalifla legendary summon banner, but we'll also be getting the thank you celebration slash Tana Bata banner that we didn't get for the actual thank you celebration, except this time it's gonna be called the Merry Christmas Dokkan Festival Summon or Dokkan Festival Banner. Now obviously I think there's gonna be a regular stone banner where we can summon with dragon stones, but I also believe that there's gonna be a separate ticket banner with the same featured units that we can summon on with our free Christmas summon tickets. And at this point in time, we should all have at least three tickets from missions for part one. But if you go into the login bonuses, we're also getting three more for Christmas Eve, which is, uh, of course, December 24th. And there's also part two missions to consider. So let's say we get three or more from that. Then, okay, no, you know what? Let's say it's four, because I think it'd be kind of a dick move for Bandai to give us three more for a total of nine and be one ticket short of a multi. So let's say 
from missions for part 2, we get 4 more, so a total of 10 tickets for a free multi on the thank you celebration slash Christmas ticket banner. I mean, of course, like I said in the beginning of this video, I could be completely off base about this, but I honestly think this is what's going to happen. The way it's going to go down is we're going to get the LR Kale and Khalifa Legendary Summon Banner announced in the in-game news for part 2 of the celebration, but no mention of this Tanabata banner. And then on Christmas or Christmas Eve, when we wake up in the morning, we open our phones and boom, out of nowhere, the Tanabata banner is there with the ticket banner. We're going to get our tickets from Login for a total of 10 Christmas tickets for a free multi on the Tanabata banner for a chance to pull LR GoBros or the LR Super Saiyan Force for free. And of course, um, these three should also be available in the uh, coin shop too. So for people that don't pull them, you can also buy them with coins. And uh, I just think it'd be really cool. It'd be a really cool thing for Bandai to do. It'd be probably the nicest Christmas surprise or Christmas gift they've ever given us on Global. And I think part of this prediction is more so just wishful thinking, but you guys can see it happening, right? I I'm sure you can. I'm sure you can. So that is my prediction, guys. That's what I think is going to happen. That's the way I think it's going to go down. Uh, maybe not. Maybe we'll just get this in the in-game news so that we know it's coming. But either way, I do believe that the Christmas tickets are for the Tanabata banner, and uh, it should be a really, really good Christmas on Global this year. So that's my prediction guys. Let me know in the comments down below what you think about it and let me know whether or not you agree with me. If you disagree, that's totally, totally fine. I would love to hear your thoughts about these Christmas tickets. And before we go, I just want to say one more time, disclaimer, I don't know anything for sure. So everything I've said could be completely wrong. Like honestly, I feel like there's a chance that this Christmas banner is just going to be the exact same banner we got for the download celebration, which would be fine, but nowhere near as exciting, nowhere near as hype as the Tanabata banner. So I'm really crossing my fingers, really hoping that it's the Tanabata banner and not something a lot less exciting like the download celebration banner. So there you go, guys. That's going to do it for today's video. That's all I got to say. Um, as always, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and if you liked the video, then make sure to like the damn video, and if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, and you'll like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now, and while you're at it, hit that notification bell too, so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. Of course, once official information comes out about these Christmas tickets and exactly what they're for, I'll make an updated video to let you guys know. And if I end up being 100% correct, then I'm going to gloat a little bit. But you know what? I think I deserve that if that's the case, right? So <laughs> that's it. I'm out of here. Until next time, I hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media, signing out.